Alfred Hershey and Martha Chase worked on a virus composed only of proteins and DNA, a simple experimental system in which to test which of these substances was the genetic material. In the life cycle of a virus, the virus finds a bacterial host to which it attaches. Once attached, the virus injects its genetic material into the bacterial cell and subsequently directs the production of new viruses. The cell then ruptures, releasing hundreds of copies of the viruses that can then repeat the cycle with other bacterial cells. The researchers based their experiments on the fact that DNA contains phosphorus, while protein does not, and that protein contains sulfur, while DNA does not. Hershey and Chase grew the viruses on bacterial cells in a medium containing either radioactive sulfur or radioactive phosphorus. In one experiment, the resulting viruses contained radioactively labeled protein coats. In the other, the viruses contained radioactively labeled DNA. The radioactively labeled viruses were then incubated with living bacterial cells, giving the viruses time to inject their genetic material into the cells. Following incubation, Hershey and Chase placed the cultures in a blender. During the blending process, the viruses were dislodged from the surface of the bacterial cells. Once dislodged,